Let's stay mm. north of 10K. Go to the guy from Northern Ireland, and that is Rory McIlroy, who is 10300 bucks. Chase or fade, Reed, he makes a run in Tokyo. Jeff and I talked about this yesterday, where I, the stats are lining up, where he's playing better, his ball striking is better, but what's this guy's motivation? <laughs> he said he there's nothing really to look forward to. Uh, what you this might have been like his his over championship hangover. Um, it it might have been a lot of a, a couple of things. Maybe he's tired. Maybe he just wants to stay home. I uh, said he wasn't that patriotic. So with all those things considered, which is a stark difference from guys like Joaquin Neiman, guys like Cam Smith, who are extremely prideful, and Colin Morikawa, who is so excited to be representing the USA and the Olympics, Rory's on the exact opposite. So I, I'm, you know, I'd, I'd rather play him over Hideki, but both of those guys, Hideki and Rory, I just don't, don't have much confidence. I'd rather eat the chalk in those top three guys and leave these two guys for everyone else to kind of play around with. I mean, Moose, can't he be motivated by just that fancy, cool gold medal? I mean, absolutely. I mean, there's there, there can be some motivation for, for Rory, but I, I'm I'm of the, the exact same opinion as Reed here. Uh, I'd probably rather play him than Hideki. Rory's approach game has been really consistent coming into this event, which is really the only thing that intrigues me about him. But you look at what he's done, especially compared to those top three Americans uh, outside of even, even the Wells Fargo, he barely closed it out over, uh, you know, Abraham answers. So it wasn't exactly the most inspiring win ever. And now like in that field, you didn't have guys like Justin Thomas, Xander Shoffley to, to deal with guys who just always come to play, especially in these limited field events, WGCs. We just haven't seen Rory be able to close these out. He's still over 10 K here. You know, you've got guys like Hovland Casey under 10 K. I just feel like Rory's actually a little bit overpriced here. And if you're going to pay up for 10, three, you might as well get up to Xander or Justin Thomas at 10, seven or 10, nine. So I'm kind of out on Rory. Maybe I'll play him over Hideki, but that that's like the only kind of take I have for him.